What's up everybody, it's Patrick, also known as Steezus, and welcome to my archive. If this is your first time watching, welcome to my channel, and if you've watched my other videos in the past, welcome back. In today's video, we'll be continuing our hunt for Rayquaza, and we'll be opening up one half of this Evolving Skies booster box. We got 18 packs in this video, and we'll be opening the second half in next week's video, so make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video so you don't miss out on that, so we can go ahead and move over to the setup and continue our hunt for Rayquaza and open up these packs. We can go ahead and start unwrapping this booster box. We'll be opening up the first 18 packs and in these booster box I usually like starting with the left side. That's just something I always do when I open a booster box. And we're coming up on the release of the new set Brilliant Stars. So expect a pack or a set battle between Evolving Skies and Brilliant Stars when that comes out. We got our first 18 packs here so we can set these off to the side and start breaking into them. We'll go ahead and kick things off with this Rayquaza pack art. My two chase cards are the Rayquaza alternate arts as well as the Umbreon V alternate art. This is one of my favorite sets, so we'll see if we can get some first pack magic out of this first half. We got the Fighting Energy, the Pyroar, Vigoroth, Treasure Energy, Feebas, Hippopotas, Lillipup, Nicket, Bergmite, the reverse hollow is Molga, and then the first rare is a Dracozolt VMAX. So we did get some first pack magic out of the left side. The first 18 packs out of a booster box, I'm traditionally expecting around eight hits in total. So we'll go ahead and add that to the background. We'll break into the Sylveon pack and make sure to leave a comment on which side of the booster box you think will do better and have the better pulls. If you're team left side or team right side, we got our code card, four from the back, and this pack starts with the fire energy. We got Palpitoad, Shopping Center, Herdier, Rufflet, Lotad with no thoughts, just vibes, Emolga, Woobat, Gossifleur, the reverse holo is an Appleton, and then the rare is a Zygarde, and this is a rare holo, so two for two so far, and we can go ahead and set this off to the side for our recap. Let's see if we can continue these white code cards with this Umbreon pack and see what's inside. I'm super excited for the new set. I didn't put any pre-orders in, but I'm hoping to find some while I go hunt on release day. And th then we can do a set battle between Evolving Skies and Brilliant Stars. There's some beautiful artworks in that set. We got the Psychic Energy, Boldor, Aroma Lady, Moon and Sun Badge, Rufflet, Lotad with No Thoughts, Just Vibes, Emolga, Woobat, Gossifleur, the reverse hollow is Teddy Ursa in the flower field, and then the rare is a Drampa the Grandpa, and this is a non hollow. Let's see what's hiding in the skyscraper pack. There are so many great cards in Evolving Skies, and there are some amazing cards and brilliant stars as well, so that'll be a super fun set battle with the return of the character rares. We got the Metal Energy, Braviary. Lucky Ice Pop, Tentacruel, Hitmonchan Punching Through the Rain, Slack Off Hanging on the Edge, Back to Back Favorites, The Petalil, Pikachu, Pumpkaboo, the Reverse Hollow is a Gorgas, so it looks like we got the evolution of the Pumpkaboo, and then the Rare is a Smeargle, and this is a non hollow Rayquaza on this one, still hoping to pull those alternate arts or even the Secret Rainbow Rare Rayquaza VMAX or the Rayquaza V Full Art. Those are some beautiful cards and I'm hoping to add those to my collection. Four from the back and this one starts with the Water Energy. We got Herdier, Single Strike Scroll of the Fang Dragon, a Tongue Twister card, Floet, Hitmonchan Punching Through the Rain, Slack Off Hanging on the Edge, a Petalil, Pikachu, Pumpkaboo, looking like that last pack. We got the Nuzleaf as the reverse hollow, and then the rare 
is a Gyarados V, and this is a card I do not have in my collection yet, so I'm super happy to pull this one. So we can go ahead and grab a sleeve as I bump the camera there, and we'll go ahead and sleeve this Gyarados V up and add it to our background. We got the Sylveon on this next pack. I'm super happy about that Gyarados V. One of my favorite cards of all time is the Shining Gyarados from Neo Revelation. I do own that card, probably one of my top three in my collection. My favorite as a kid. We have the Grass Energy, the Scrafty, Snow Leaf Badge, Hippopowdon, Dwebble, Mareep, Drowsy, Scraggy running for his life, the Feebas, Aroma Lady as the Reverse Hollow, and then the Rare is a Pinsir, and this is a non-hollow rare. We'll break into this Umbreon pack and see if there's any good cards inside. I do have a hard time keeping a sealed collection just because you never know what's inside of a pack of Pokemon cards, so I just want to rip them all open because I always have a feeling that my chase card is in there. This pack starts with the Lucky Lightning Energy, the first energy we pulled on the channel. We got Toy Catcher, Hippopowdon, Golduck, Dwebble, Mareep, Drowsy, Scraggy running for his life, the Feebas, Rubber Gloves as the Reverse Hollow, and then the Rare is a Leafeon V alternate art. Another alternate art that I do already have in my collection, but this is such a beautiful artwork on this card. So we'll go ahead and sleeve this one up and we can add it to our background. So far, this first half of the box has had some amazing hits and I'm hoping to add at least one more to the background in this half. I'm a big fan of that Leafeon alternate art. I do already have that one, but the artwork on it reminds me of the fall season, and it's such a cool card. We'll break into this next pack and see if we can get another alternate art out of this box. So far, it looks like Team Left Side is doing very well. We got the Fighting Energy, Swoobat, Lombre, Lucky Ice Pop, Love Disc, C Dot, Slack Off Hanging on the Edge. Flabebe, Carvana Wana Rayquaza, Tentacool as the reverse, and then the rare is a Gigalith, and this is a rare non hollow. We got our boy on the front of this pack, hoping to pull the V Max, that is probably my main chase card, but the Rayquaza V alternate art is just as good. I would be super happy with either of those for my collection. We got the Fire Energy to start this one. Palpitode, Crustle, Moon and Sun Badge, Love Disc, C Dot, Slack Off Hanging on the Edge, Flabebe, Carvana Wana Rayquaza, Victini as the Reverse Hollow, and then the Rare is a Sharpedo, and this is a non hollow rare. We're halfway through this first half of the booster box. We'll break into this Duraludon pack and see if we can get another hit for our background. Still haven't pulled our secret rare, so hopefully we get that Rayquaza VMAX alternate art as our secret rare. Four from the back, and this one starts with the Grass Energy. We got the Snow Leaf Badge, Gordy, Zuelus, Cutie Fly, Hitmonchan Punching Through the Rain, Lotad with No Thoughts, Just Vibes, Sableye, Teddy Ursa in the Flower Field, the reverse hollow is a Scrafty, and then the rare is a Leafeon VMAX. So it looks like our Leafeon V evolved into the VMAX form. So I'll go ahead and try to grab a sleeve here, and then we can sleeve this up for our background. So we got our second VMAX hit of the box in the Leafeon V. So I'll add that to the background. I always love seeing a full background, so we'll go ahead and break into this Rayquaza and see if this left side has any more hits for us. We got this pack cracked open, we got our code card there, and then four from the back, and it looks like we start with the Lucky Lightning Energy, the first energy we pulled on the channel, the Crystal Cave, Toy Catcher, Raihan, Litleo, Chinchow, Dino, Pumpkaboo, Carvana Wana Rayquaza, 
We got Zygarde as the reverse holo, and then the rare is a Cresselia, and this is a gold secret rare, so another great hit. This left side is doing so well. I love these gold Pokemon cards, and these are a shiny version. So we can go ahead and sleeve this up, and we'll adjust our background here, and we can add another stand over to the left, and we can add this beautiful gold secret rare to our background. This has been such a great box so far. We'll break open to this Sylveon pack, but that Cresselia gold card is such a beautiful artwork probably my favorite gold card out of this set so we'll go ahead and do four from the back and this one starts with the fighting energy we got rescue carrier crystal cave avalug scraggy running for his life hippopotas time pole litleo eevee hunting for that rayquaza the zuelus as the reverse hollow and then the rare is a thievel and this is a non hollow We got six packs left, including this Umbreon, and we'll see if we can add anything else to our background. Five cards out of one half is great. Traditionally, you do get eight hits out of a booster box. Sometimes you get more, sometimes you get less, but hopefully we can get some more out of this half and the other half of the booster box. This one starts with the Fire Energy, the Rescue Carrier, Scrafty, Ursa Ring, Scraggy running for his life, Hippopotas, Time Pool, Flabebe, Swablu, the reverse hollow is a Pumpkaboo, and then the rare is an Ampharos, and this is a non hollow rare. We got a Skyscraper pack, and we will see what we can get out of this one. I do like opening booster boxes as my cat runs around in the background, but they do have a solid amount of guaranteed hits. This one starts with the Metal Energy, we got Lantern, Ursa Ring, Crustle, Dino, Pumpkaboo, Carvana Wanna Rayquaza, Gossifleur, Fletchling, the Reverse Hollow is an Aroma Lady, and then the Rare is a Noivern V. So another hit for this left side, our sixth hit of the video is a Noivern V. So another great pull that we can sleeve up and we'll slide in another stand and add this to the edge of our background. So far, team left side has been killing it. We'll open up this Rayquaza pack, but if you're team left side, you're looking really good, but stay tuned and make sure you're subscribed for next week's video where we open up the second half of this box and see if we can get any more pulls. It looks like we only have one rare hollow so far out of this box and six hits. We got the Water Energy, Tentacruel, Bulldore, Aroma Lady, Dino, Pumpkaboo, Carvana Wanna Rayquaza, Gossifleur, Fletchling, the Reverse Hollow is a Great Value Moltres and a Talonflame, and then the Rare is a Flapple, and this is a non hollow Rare. We got three more packs here, we'll break it open into the Sylveon. So far, we've gotten quite a few hits and I love seeing a full background and we did pull that secret rare Cresselia and an alternate art out of this first hack and that is super exciting. I love opening a great booster box. We got the Skip Loom, a card that I don't often pull, the Fletchender, Shopping Center, Rog and Rolla, Flabebe, Swablu, Litleo, Chinchow, the reverse hollow is a treasure energy, and then the rare is a great value Moltres and a non hollow Talon Flame. We got our Umbreon pack here, and we'll break this one open and see what's inside of this one. We got our code card, four from the back, and this one starts with the grass energy. We got the ribbon badge, Braviary, switching cups. Rog and Rolla, Flabebe, Swablu, Litleo, Chinchow, Golduck as the reverse holo, and then the rare is a Salamance, and this is another rare holo, so I'll go ahead and set this off to the side for our recap. 
And the final pack of this video in the first half of the booster box, we have the Duraludon on this one. And we'll see if we can get some last pack magic out of this pack. Got our code card. Four from the back. And this one starts with the Lucky Lightning energy, the first energy we pulled on the channel. We got Pyroar, Dream Ball, Stormy Mountains, Feebas, Hippopotas, Lillipup, Nicket, Bergmite, the reverse hollow is a time pull, and then the final rare of the video is a Lilligant, and this is a non hollow. So I'll go ahead and get cleaned up here and we can move into our recap. Moving into our quick recap, we got two rare hollows the Zygarde as well as the Salamance. We got the Noivern V, the Gyarados V, two V Maxes in the Dracozolt V Max as well as the Leafeon V Max. We did pull an alternate art Leafeon V, one that I do already have, but a beautiful artwork. I do love the colors on this one. And then my favorite pull of the video was our secret rare Cresselia Gold card. This is a shiny version, a super cool Pokemon design, so I was happy to add this to my collection so I can add it to the gold section of my binder. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on the second half leave a comment if you think the second half will beat this first half of this booster box and stay tuned for more videos so thank you all for watching and i hope you have a great day